I am Margaret Grant. I'm the president of the Barbados Association of Guidance Counselors, as well as the council of the St. Michael's School. This is the 13th national career showcase that we have had here in Barbados. And this is a project that we have been working on as guidance counselors, because we do recognize that career planning is very important. And if we can get students to understand the importance and relevance of career planning to how they study in school as well as their future, we would have accomplished a great task. This year we have included several exhibits because we have 16 career clusters that we are actually incorporating in this showcase. And with 16 career clusters, we have left out no career. So we are moving from agriculture, from A, agriculture, we have arts, audio video, we have human services, education, um, marketing, science, technology, mathematics, engineering, we also have construction, we have um, transportation and logistics, we have manufacturing. So we have actually tried our best to incorporate all 16 clusters and by doing that our aim was to capture the interest of every child so that no matter what career you're interested in it would have been covered and one that I need to mention would be corrections and security as well as business management finance administration so the whole gamut of careers is here as far as students are concerned we have given them a bike with a booklet. In that booklet, they have some questions that they can actually ask when they go to the various booths. So if students can just ask those questions, the name of the career, the type of career it is, the qualifications that are necessary, the work environment, um, opportunities for study, opportunities for training. If students can just ask all those questions at the various moves that they go to, they will leave here more with their knowledge base really expanded. They would leave here with several options as well. They will leave here more open-minded, having a more growth mindset rather than a fixed mindset. One thing that we've added this year was the student entrepreneurship program. We, we know that in our secondary schools, the SBA has been working with some students and they have the entrepreneurship program. And with this program, they actually have incorporated students to work with their own business projects. And we have about, we have a good set of students here from varying schools exhibiting their products or services. And from the view of it, it seems to be a highlight because many students, participants, are actually capitalizing on the products and the services. And I mean, these are ranging from smoothies. You have smoothies, you have cupcakes, you have um, eyebrow blush, um, makeup, all sorts of things are here. So we are really seeing this as a positive in terms of our entrepreneurship drive in Barbados.